Always remember the Cubone. Cubone is like that cube. We gotta name that Cubone and be all like that. We do it for the Cubone. I don't see how pl I mean, people can actually play an all sneak run of this, these types of games. Linden? Ooh, that's a good, that's an interesting name. We can do, yeah, Linden sounds actually a cool idea. Linden the Cubone. I like that. But that's what we're going with. Anyways, I have a power drill and plywood and a box of screws and a glass of wine. So we should. Oh God, everyone, take your bets on how this goes for Adrian. Please, Adrian, be safe about all this though. Don't be stupid. Please, 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 please. Don't do anything stupid. Named at the present Lyndon Johnson. Yeah, there you go. Not a bad choice when you think about it. Rev's power drill, I got this yo. That does not install confidence, Adrian. That that, that that does not install any form of confidence. Because I'm picturing you doing that with that like wicked smile of I know what I'm doing, I hope. What do you got? Nothing good. Why the fuck do you guys have nothing good I can use? Rip. Exactly. It will be a big rippy dip dip. Ripping pepperonis. Clinic basement key. What was this? What's the terminal say? Dispenser codes. Medex. Oh yeah. Medex is good. Oops. Siedra Madre Martine. Let's make some of those. I really, really need to find one of those damn things to re mean to recycle all my microfusion cells. The rolling pin is the best weapon. Well, if we're playing Player Unknown Battlegrounds, the frying pan is the best weapon. But we're not playing that. We're playing Fallout, so like you're not that you're, not, you're probably not that far off. Pre-war books. The heartbeat thudding is so not helping. Hey, I found some wine. Yeah, like that. That, like, thump, 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 thump is so atmospherically, like, intimidating. Okay, that's outside. Why did it just beep?
Oh, right. Is it this terminal? Gas leak, safety suits, nope. There's gotta be a terminal nearby. I just forget where. I think it's downstairs, actually. Is it in the basement? I think it is. A workbench, thank God. Recycle all these things. Books, wine, you only need a drill and you can be Adrian. Wow. Uh, da, 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 Let's go with five DC Journal Journal of Medicine. Toolbox that you did. Anything else you can make? Weapon market repair kit. Those things are never gonna run ass style. I just realized I can use regular ammo, I mean, microfusion cells now. Or not. Disengage main power. That drilling noise is god awful. So god awful. Malfunctioning auto dock. Hmm. Heal all crippled limbs. Ugh, I hate that noise so much. The woman before you looks disoriented, pained. She blinks a few times and then something. Are you all right? Who are you? Looks like someone's card to roadmap on your face. I'm gonna go with the, are you all right? She looks at you, blinks again, then opens her mouth, but nothing comes out. She touches her throat, then traces a scar beneath her chin and her eyes widen in alarm. Look, I'm here to help. She looks shaken as she glances at the auto dock. She recoils and opens her mouth again. Nothing comes out. She looks back at you, her hands Clench in a fist, her eyes narrow. She takes a step back, studying you. This isn't what it looks like. The woman opens her mouth again, winces, then frowns. Drags her finger across her throat in slow motion. Frowning, she touches her throat again, gently. Then her hand brushes the collar. Her frown deepens. Her eyes narrow, and she traces the edges of the collar until she finds the lock. She begins to press it with her fingers. She looks surprised and notices your collar and raises an eyebrow. She frowns her eyes, then narrowly shakes, I mean, sh slowly shakes her head. We need to cooperate if we're gonna get out of here. She shakes her head again, then draws a line in the air between the two of you. We can get out of this. Then crosses her arms, I'm not trying to order you, but your life is tied to mine. She frowns, glances at the collar, looks back at you. She makes a circle with her hands, puts her hands. She nods at you, lowers her hand from her eyes, shakes her head, draws a line between you. Um, you're looking for something else. Fine, I can help. Gives you a silent sigh. She nods at you, then raises an eyebrow and nods at the door. Come with me. Glances at 
at your follower, shakes her head, then points. Oh, okay. Oh, right, because I only had Dean. Glances around your collar, frowning. It's a decayed speaker. If we stay too long near one, it'll go off. She taps the collar and then opens and closes her hand really fast. Taps her collar and opens and closes it really fast. She points at your print boy, her collar, then your collar. After a second, she opens and closes her hand slower. You can dampen the signal somehow? Why not give her a pencil and paper? They explain that in a bit. Um, does it work with any other collar? It's just your frequency. But only between us. But yeah, they do explain why they can't give her a pencil and paper. Um, let's go with science. No. Looks like I'm going to be using um, hollow rifle a lot. Um, 50. The last five points I'll put into... Put into speech. Confirm bachelor. Yeah, let's go confirm bachelor, get more uh, conversation options. Christine. Um, do you know how to really do you know how to get out of here? She moves her finger in a circle, frowns, and drags her hand down over her eyes. She raises them again, points to you. You were knocked out. Raises an eyebrow, points to you, makes a circle, then points to your feet. You wanna know how I got here. Still pointing the ground between you, she raises an eyebrow. After a second, she raises her eyebrow again. Um, couldn't even tell you why, I just did. Points at you, then points at the casino, then slowly shakes her head. Points in the direction of the main gate. If I could leave, I would. You're not gonna leave. Without strength or conviction, she isn't looking at you when she does. If I could leave, I would. I have other questions. Uh, what weapons are you skilled at? Jagged lightning bolt, pantomimes, throwing a grenade, and then sh sh sh. so she's pretty much good with everything. I love how she is like good with every fighting technique. Hey Moist, what's up? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Hi, hopefully you're doing well tonight. Ali Din.
Come on, hit him. There we go. Took out the leg. Nice, nice, nice. If you host, you can see Linden. Where's Dean? Oh, there he is. Um, that's enough for now. No. It's not what I wanted. Time for us to part ways. Yes, I'm sure. You're too kind to believe in us. I'll unlock the west and east gates to Puesta del Sol and Salida del Sol. Now that you survived the villa, I need to get to my position. You don't need me to hold your hand anymore. I'll keep monitoring you via the transceivers through the villa. If I need to offer guidance, I will. What is the gala event? A display of lights, fireworks, music in the streets. A pre-war festival to mark the casino's opening. The bomb struck first. It is of no consequence, only firing the event is. Get the three in position. And travel to your position, and it's a leader del sol, and trigger the gala. Gala. After that, the real work begins. Okay, what do you mean? I actually think this is a simple robbery. A cheap casino heist. I mean, it kind of is. No, no. This is a heist of the centuries. We're not plundering Sierra Madre. We're plundering history. Taking from the old world itself. It won't let its secrets go easily. Not without a fight. I wouldn't expect anything less. Well, we'll head out then. I'd suggest taking the FEV reject to his position first. Although you may need his brutality and strength elsewhere. As easy as the villa was to navigate, the outlying areas of the villa are far more dangerous, thicker with the ghost traps and toxins. Use your team as I use you. Listen to your caller. Watch where you step. You are no use to be dead. Charming to the last. <laughs> 